Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal. I'm here today in a new Indian restaurant that opened recently in Jerusalem. It's called Itchy Kadna. This place is located on Hillel Street, which is one of the main streets in the center of Jerusalem. They specialize in Indian food from the Rajasthan region of India. It is uh, dairy and it's under the supervision of Zohar, which is of course a uh, different cash route organization than the Rabbinate. If you're not Jewish, none of this stuff matters to you. What matters to you is that they do good Indian food. We just ordered a few dishes. We're gonna see uh, how this place fares. Namaste, my name is Nick, and I'm from India, Rajasthan. And I'm living uh, in Israel from the last, since the last 10 years. So two weeks before uh, we opened up our new restaurant, which is done in Jerusalem in Lakhov uh, Street, in Hillel Street, 24. Food is we bring from all parts of uh, from India, from North, East, West, from everywhere, the street food and everything. We, we like to give the, the Indian vibe, not just Indian food, also Indian vibe, Indian, uh, Indian music, in everything. What can we do is we give to our culture, to people. For someone who's never heard about Indian food, what would you recommend on the menu? Uh, there's a lot of uh, to try, and the best food I think I recommend you Malai Kofta, Palak Paneer, Masala Dosa, Samosa, everything is very, you know, like Indian food is uh, everything very tasty. Is anything coming to the menu that we should be excited about? Uh, soon we're gonna have like more uh, special thing. Two weeks uh, we have new menu, what we have, we're gonna change the menu, and a lot of uh, surprises we bring from the all over Asia. Uh, I think people just boring to uh, eat like shawarma, falafel and all this every time. Something new, you know, like a new experiment, new taste with a lot of uh, ingredients, a lot of uh, masalas from India. So it will be fun. When I visited tonight, Ichikana had only been in operation for a little over two weeks. So I imagine that their menu is going to be in flux as they find their footing. They did have some classics already like Palak Paneer, Malai Kofta and Matar Paneer. But other classics like Chana Masala were conspicuously absent as well as beer. But Nikhil told me that they're going to be adding those to the menu in the coming weeks. Our total came to 144 shekels for a Mali Kofta, a Coca-Cola, a Masala chips, which were excellent by the way, and a Darkatal. And at today's exchange rate, that's about $42. So not the cheapest, but also not too expensive. I'm just delighted that there is more Indian food in Jerusalem. Thanks for watching. More videos coming to this YouTube channel very soon.